MP Stella Creasy releases a call to action to end anti-abortion harassment in Walthamstow. We respond to this statement and give you an update of the Stop Stella campaign. I'm Ruth Rawlins reporting for CBR UK. So we've been in Walthamstow for around three weeks now and we have had five public education displays so far. Every display in Walthamstow has been different. We have had the council rip down one of our displays and actually confiscate it. We have had socialist protesters come out in large numbers to block our displays. They literally stalked our volunteers and harassed them. And yet on the last display, we were extremely grateful to the police who were there that day in that they separated the socialist protesters from our volunteers and allowed them to do their protests and us to do our public education display. So we were very grateful to the police for that. The council have been trying to shut us down on every display they can. So let me go to this statement that Stella Creasy released last week on Instagram and Twitter. It's, as I said, it's called Walthamstow End Anti-Abortion Harassment. And it starts, the CBR UK are targeting women in Walthamstow. Well, we're targeting everyone in Walthamstow. They want publicity and to be seen as a leg legitimate form of protest. We ask people not to engage with them or seek to disrupt their protests because this encourages the police to see such activities as equal and as both sides of a debate. Then they protect this group as a public order issue. It is not. It is harassment. Stella Creasy has spoken. Want to stop this? Here's four ways you can help. So number one, build the evidence case. If you see them, please report them as a form of harassment to the police and Wartham Forest Council by calling 101 or visiting, and then it's got the website. Did you hear that? If you see them, please report them as a form of harassment to the police. Not if you see them harass someone, if you literally see them. So now it is becoming a crime or it's becoming harassment to literally be seen as a member of CBR UK or as a pro-lifer in Walthamstow. Wow. That should concern anyone who cares about expressive rights. You may not be for or against abortion, but your expressive rights could be next if they don't line up with MP Stella Carisi's or if they somehow criticise something that she promotes. Number two, she continues, make a donation towards an abortion rights charity so that their harassment is directly funding abortion access. And she mentions the British Pregnancy Advisory Service, which is basically an abortion clinic or abortion support network. So Stella Creasy is very quick to remind us that this is not about abortion, it's about stopping harassment. Yeah, she wants um, abortion to be funded. I think a lot of your Walthamstow residents will not be very happy about that because not many of them, or not all of them, should I say, are for abortion. Many of them are, in fact, against abortion, particularly at 24, 25, 26, 27, 28 weeks, which Stella Creasy wants to legalise. Number three, write to the Law Commission to back making misogyny as a hate crime alongside racism and homophobia. And she gives an email address for the Hate Crime Commission. So now it's misogynistic, it's somehow anti-women to educate on the humanity of the unborn child and to stand up for babies that are being intentionally killed in the womb. Misogynistic? 90%, 80% of our volunteers are actually women. So you're saying that we're all anti ourselves, anti women? Hmm, interesting. And then lastly, she says, join Walthamstow Sisters Supporter Group. Well, I think that should concern a lot of people because a lot of people um, who care about expressive rights, whether you agree with abortion or not, we should all have the right, particularly, to criticise what politicians 
are doing or trying to promote or trying to put forward are they not a certain politicians not able to be held to account mp stella creasy seems to think so why because she's pregnant because she's a woman i'm not sure but i think everyone who cares about freedom of expression it's great to see that um, journalists now are writing about this from a freedom of speech perspective and saying that people need to beware as if she she's not meant to be a monarch with subjects but she's meant to be a MP representing the people and it is a scary precedent that she is setting or trying to set setting the police on those peacefully engaging people for conversation on um, debate so we'd also like to mention Stella Creasy also shared that she had had a hate a hate letter sent to herself and we totally condemn that whoever sent that is is a horrible thing to do and we hope that she will report it to the police and that they will find whoever it was that sent it and they shall be held to account for their actions. We do not promote or support hate of any types. And so there you have it. I'm sure there will be more to come. And thank you for your support. We will be back in Walthamstow this week. So keep peeled. You can see, catch up on all of the live action on our Facebook page, CBR UK. And we have all, we stream all of the displays. So you can decide for yourself, is it harassment or is it just information and conversation? Decide for yourself and, and let us know. Um, keep supporting. You can donate at cbruk.org. Up, get updates on the, on the campaign, stopstella.com. Thank you for your support.